And a welcome back to Sports Weekly on IEMG. I'm your host, Pep Fernandez. We appreciate you tuning in. In this segment, we're going to pay a visit to the Ken Hubs Award. This is a very old award and very prestigious, going to the top athletes in San Bernardino County. And when you look at the history of this award, some of the all-time greats in our area have won this award and gone, gone on to do very big things. So let's go out to Indian Springs High School, and it was a packed House Ken Hubs, of course, from Colton High School, uh, played in the major leagues with the Chicago Cubs before, unfortunately, his life was cut short in a plane accident. But he was a great player for the Cubs, a great defensive player, the pride of Colton, and that's where the awards come from. And you can see some of the uh, winners of this year's award. So each school has a boys winner and a girls winner. That was Eric Batanti from Aquinas High School Baseball. Jaquan Smith there from Cajon High School. That's football and track and field. So each school has an individual winner for boys and girls. And then there's the overall winner. And that for, uh, for the girls was Christine Carpenter, a big time water polo player from Ukaipa High School. She was the overall girls winner of the Ken Hubs Award. So congratulations to Christine. And on the boys' side, it's Brockton Liam from Citrus Valley High School. Uh, he is a big-time football star that will be taking his talents to Fresno State next year. So Brockton Liam for the boys going to play football at Fresno State. And Christine Carpenter, she will be playing water polo at Stanford. So two big-time winners this year for the Ken Hubs Award. And uh, we had a chance to uh, talk to Brockton Liam after he won the award and what it means to him, all the history, the legacy behind the Ken Hubs. Definitely means a lot, uh, you know, having all those guys that have won this award and then went big time, you know, Jalen Phillips, uh, Ronnie, uh, Ronnie Fouch, a lot, a lot of big time names that have come through this and then, you know, made their careers uh, in sports and outside of the field too. Yeah, it definitely does. Um, you know, all that stuff, like it, it's, it's not easy, you know, if it was easy, everybody would do it. So definitely it makes, you know, winning something as valuable as this, you know, it makes all that hard work worth it and makes me want to just keep on working to hopefully keep on getting better and better awards, so. Miss Brand, you will definitely be missed, and we all wish you the greatest in retirement. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Miss Carmel Brand. <laughs> And Pacific High School Athletic Director Carmel Brand also being honored and recognized. 30 years at Pacific, 20 as the athletic director, retiring at the end of this school year. It's been a great run for Carmel Brand with the Pacific Pirates. Well, I heard about the Ken Hubs Award when I started at Pacific in 1990, and I followed over the years all the kids that won it, and I never thought I'd be the one that would be honored here after 33 years and 20 years of being an athletic director. So that was quite a, a surprise and an honor. Uh, I like going to work every day. I do like working with my colleagues. Uh, doing the women in sports gave me great satisfaction. I've done that for 12 years, and I did promise Rich and Briani two more years on his watch as president. Um, but I just like the collegiality, I like my colleagues, I like my administration, and that makes it fun to go to work every day. I love the kids, they, they're a challenge, but I do love the kids. And looking around the room tonight, I saw all these other colleagues, ADs, who when I took over this job, I considered them rivals. Now they're my best friends. I'd just like to thank everybody who's been so gracious over the years. Win, lose, or draw, we always had a good time. And it was always nice working with people like you and other ADs and administrators at all the other schools. Congratulations to Carmel Brand on a well-earned retirement. And also out there at the Ken Hubs Awards, we had a chance to run into San Gorgonio boys soccer coach Adrian Villalobos. Of course, it was the uh, best season, a historic season for San G boys soccer, a CIF Southern Section Championship, and a SoCal 
regional state championship as well. And uh, congrats going out to Coach Villalobos, named the California Soccer Coach of the Year. He will be awarded um, the big time hardware at a ceremony in San Diego next month. But of all the coaches in the state of California, Coach Villalobos taking home the California Boys Soccer Coach of the Year. What a great award. And uh, out there at the Ken Hubs Award, we had a chance to track down Coach Villalobos to talk about the award and his excitement um, just about this year's team. If he's had a chance to really soak it in and realize the history they made at San Gorgonio this year. Here is head coach Adrian Villalobos. A uh, pretty amazing feeling, honestly. You know, I've been coaching uh, for 16 years, and it's just, uh, you know, the the hard work that, you know, even though I'm the one getting recognized, it's just, you know, the whole, uh, the, the, all the history, the team, uh, the administrators, you know, and, and the, the reason why this happened was because of, of the team, you know, the San Gregorian High School team that put the, the, the final, you know, uh, matches together, you know, they, we put on a good show um, and it came from that. You know, in a way, I'm glad it's over, uh, even though it was a fantastic, magical run. And uh, it, it's, you know, now, now we can breathe. And, uh, yeah, getting, getting this recognition was, was pretty amazing. But like I said, I'm, I'm the one being recognized, but it's, it's truly a Sanji uh, recognition. It's exciting. We're, we're, we're all excited for, for next season. Um, you know, we're still going to have a good team, even though we lost some key players. But, you know, we, we have a lot of good returning players coming back. And definitely, it, it's almost like a new new life, you know. Uh, it, it gave us another another uh, push there to, to keep to keep working and to keep getting better, and try to go for the for the uh, back to back. Uh. Congratulations to Coach Villalobos, great guy and great coach. Can't wait to see some pictures from the uh, award ceremony in June in San Diego. Well, that's going to do it for this edition of Sports Weekly. Make sure you subscribe to the IE Media Group YouTube channel. My name is Pep Fernandez, and we'll see you next time.